Hey everybody, welcome to another Horizon Zero Dawn video. On this one, we're going to go help old Aaron out over at Red Ridge Pass and see what happened to his sister. We also got a level up on the last one, so we can go ahead and get that sweet ass Concentration Plus. Yeah. Now we can go into slow-mo even longer. So we got it. Now, we can head off to this pass. It's right up here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I got the wrong thing marked. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, it's right up here. Shouldn't be much in our way. Well, I thought nothing was going to be in our way. What the hell's going on over here? Oh, we got a robo battle. Oh, are they fighting him? Y'all fighting my guy? Yeah. Where you at? Oh. Oh God. <laughs> oh yeah, look at that concentration plus. Tear him up. Oh shit. <laughs> Get off me, big chicken. Oh, that's the big Zale. That ain't the big chicken. Come on, man. What up? Oh man, <laughs> totally missed. That was terrible. Oh shit. All right, let's fight then. Yeah, get beat that's down. Over with. Thanks for the help. Yeah, no problem, man. Let me grab this stuff before you start talking to me. <laughs> Come on over here and have a word. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. I'm coming. You see all these goodies though? You just gonna let them sit here. And one of these. Hey, come on, what are you waiting for? I'm grabbing stuff, man. Chill out. Need some health. What, you don't feel like talking? Yeah, yeah, I do. <laughs> calm down, calm down. I'm coming back. Hey, seriously, we need to talk. Yeah, we do, we do, we do. But look at all this health, man. Just look at it. And there's a save point right there. Man, I got to hit that up. No, I don't need that. Grab that stuff later. Let's get it quick real quick. All right, man. Here I come. Here I come. Just a second. What's this? What's up, man? <laughs> Just a second. No, that wasn't even healing. <laughs> Let me go get this one, too. All right, man, what's up? Don't be mad, because, you know, I offed your buddy. He was a chump-ass bitch. <laughs> what are you doing out here all alone? Where are your men? I'm not going to risk their lives. I don't mind putting my worthless ass on the line, but not theirs. Sorry I had to drag you into it. Uh, don't worry. This is just an average day for me. You know, take down some machines, track some killers. Right. I'd hate to see a busy morning for you. Ready to get started? Are you sure you're all right? Well, I'm sober, so... No. Well, I'm glad you're thinking straight at least. Don't get used to it. <laughs> Tell me exactly what happened to Ursa. Start from the beginning. No one knows for sure. She left in the middle of the night with a few of her best men. Her best men? But she didn't bring you? No. I'd been drinking a lot. And maybe she thought... Oh, damn, I don't know. I couldn't hack it. Search parties found their bodies the next day and the corpses of some shadow carja cowards. It was an ambush. The shadow carja are animals. They, they beat her so bad we can't even show her face before burial. I'm so sorry, Eric. Yeah, well, when I find the soldiers who did this, they'll be sorry too. 
Let's go beat them down. You don't have any idea why she left in the middle of the night? No. But it must have been urgent. A message, a report of some new Shadow Karja threat, I don't know. Why would the Shadow Karja do this? Because they hate us. And Ursa most of all. She teamed up with Avad to kick their asses out of Meridian. They've been licking their wounds for two years, but... They finally found a way to get back at her. All right. Show me where Ursa fell, and I'll do what I can to help. Come on, follow me. Let's go. Why don't you run me by some more health stuff, man? I don't even think I have any down here. Oh, yeah, I do. I got a couple of them. Why would Ursa come all the way out here? I don't know. It doesn't make sense. Is this Shadow Karja territory? No. They broke the ceasefire as soon as they set foot in the cliff. Alright, this is it. Where the ambush happened. Our soldiers have been over it, but maybe that fancy artifact of yours can find a clue or something. Please. I need to All find right. the bastards that did this. See what I can do. What is health at, though? Oh, that's not health. Alright, what, what we got? Oh, we got a couple different things here. There must be Shadow Karja armor. A Shadow Karja spear. Those bloodstains are not the kind that would pull around a corpse. Arrows scattered there. These look like drag marks. All right. I guess I need to examine all this stuff, huh? Did yeah. Someone move a body through here. What do you see there? This stain forms a line, as if blood dripped off the edge of something, like a cart. See? Cart tracks. I think someone moved the bodies here, then scattered them across the field. Wait. Are you saying the dead found here were killed somewhere else? But why would the Shadow Karja do that? At this point, I'm not taking it for granted that the Shadow Karja are responsible. Of course they were. Well, let's follow these tracks and find out. I like these tracks real quick. We're good to go. I get why they wanted Ursa dead. But why fake an ambush? There's more to this. And we're gonna figure it out. Once we get up this big ass mountain. What's going on up here? Some robot goodies. Yeah, that wire. I need that. Ooh, something purple. Oh, it's one of the special things. Nice. Alright, where are we going? These guys are in Shadow Karja. They're from my tribe, the Asaram. Is this how your people usually greet each other? Eyes on me, Lord. Oh shit. It's on them. Concentration, bitch. Come on. Get back up. Oh, right above his head. What the hell is he doing? This is what you train. Oh, I screw you, guy. Oh, get off me, bitch. Oh, he still hit me. Come on now. Can't get me, bitch. Heavy strike. Oh, double teamed him. All right, come on. Oh, right in the head. That was beautiful. Another one. Come on. Oh, oh man. What? What the hell was that? 
these froze up. Uh -oh. Bam. That? I think it's calling in machines. Uh -oh. Get ready. Where's the machines at? Uh oh. Alright, I got something for that ass. Who you running up on? Oh shit! <laughs> he ain't running, he's shooting. Okay, okay, I ain't dodging quick enough. Holy crap. Get off me with that. I need to see what the hell is going on here. Okay, okay. Oh, get off me, bitch. Blow up. Oh shit. There we go. More explosions. Alright, duck out, duck out. You go over here. Maybe try some of these fire arrows. Eat some fire, bitch. There we go. Exploded. <laughs> oh god. Dodging, dodging, dodging. Healing. Healing and dodging. <laughs> All right, more more explody traps. Oh shit! You ran me down, man. Oh man, come on. Healing, 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 healing and rolling, rolling and healing. Hit that trap, you big bastard. Where'd your buddy go? Oh oh shit! Right here in my face. Oh no, no shooting, no shooting. Man, it ain't stopping. All right, let's try to let's try to get a bomb on his ass. Take this, bitch! Oh, damn it! Uh huh. Oh shit! That ain't fair, man. My buddy's down. Oh, is he back up? He's back up. Nice. Get him, man. Make him stop doing all that shooting bullshit. Come on. Oh, damn. There we go. Ooh, I need to heal. Oh, God. Run, run, run. You gonna follow me, man, or what? Oh, damn. Yeah, he is gonna follow me, all right. There we go. Get off me, man. Explosion. Did we kill him? Oh, man. <laughs> that was tough. Asaram, not Shadow Karja. Looks like I was wrong about everything, as usual. Please, use that second sight of yours. I have to know what really happened. I'm on it. I got you, man. First off, I need to grab up these goodies, though. Take that. What you got? Ooh, 20 wire. Yeah. Where'd the other one go? Got some healing potion. At least we got something. <laughs> Since we just used it all up. Or all our medicine, anyway. There we go. We got us a little. Oh man, I'm tripping over this dude. Look, <laughs> I wasn't even looking at my character. I was looking at this plant over here. <laughs> wasn't even healing. Damn it! All right. So much blood. A lot of people died here. A massacre. A massacre? All right. What Those rocks. About this? They're shattered. Something hit these stones. Something I've never seen before. These look like vanguard weapons. There's no blood on them. Ursus men didn't fight back. Uh huh. Alright, so where's something else I need to scan? Gotta be over to looking at. Oh, well, up there. Okay. Nothing else here, right? Oh, wait. I looked at this one or the other one? Yeah, no, no. I didn't look at this. What are those leather straps? Armor straps. Cut with a knife. And a rock with blood on it. 
Looks like you could mount some equipment on that thing. Oh man. There. I'll jump off. By the tripod. A used power cell. What else we got? Some goodies? I'll take it. What's up, man? Talk to me. This is Ursus helmet. I thought she died in the field below, but must have been here. All this trickery for what feels like it's just a torch in me i have a theory but it takes a little imagination so far your theories are better than other people's facts all right i think the osaram ambushed ursa and her men with a new weapon they mounted it on that tripod up there it fires waves of force maybe sound Looks like it cracked the stone there. I think it paralyzes people instead of killing them. It dropped the vanguard right there. No blood on their weapons. No fight. Then why paralyze them if you're only gonna move them and gut them? They were trying to hide something. Look here, a bloody rock. That they used to smash Ursus' face in. Or someone else's. These leather straps have been cut, as if they took the armor off someone. Uh, that, that can't be. Her body is, is lying in state in Meridian. I saw it. You said she was unrecognizable. Maybe they switched another body into her armor, someone around the same size, and mutilated it enough so it could have been anyone, even Ursa. Go back to Meridian. Take another look at that body. If it's really Ursa, of course I'm wrong. But if I'm right... Then, then my sister could be alive. I, I, I'm going. Meet me back there when you can. All right, then. So she might be alive. Sweet. So, what does that do for us? Alright, let's see where this is. Way the hell back here? Alright, I think I got enough fast travel stuff. We'll fast travel back there and check him out. Alright, we're back over here in Meridian. Now we gotta go back here and meet old Aaron. See what's up. I couldn't get back here before, so I assume he's going to get me through. Also went around and got our health healed up, or, you know, got it filled back up, so we're good to go. You? Greetings, Aloy. I am known as Blameless Marad. Please come with me. You're needed for an important consultation. What do you mean? Where's Erend? He's inside, attending the Sun King, where we should be without further delay. Follow me, please. All of these people are here to see the Sun King. Yes, and each has come to ask a favor of him. Unpleasant, but that's politics. The Sun King is eager to meet you, the machine tamer with a curious eye for detail. It's all very intriguing. I'm not here to intrigue you. Too late. First the Osaram gets special treatment, and now outlanders from the Savage East? What possible interest could the Sun King have in her? Passed by some outlander woman. Better shut your mouth. I've been here for two hours, and Miss Nora goes to the front of the line. Where are we going, man? Hurry up. Won't you run? Ignore them. Nobles are like children who whine when they don't get a second helping of dessert. What's the Sun King like? The most important thing is what he isn't like. His father. I think you'll find him to be a reasonable man. Aloy of the Nora, she who sees the unseen. Welcome. It would seem you have done me a great service. Erend, tell her what you found. I, I checked Ursa's tomb. You were right, Aloy. 
The body is missing a scar below her right knee. I gave it to Ursa when we were kids, fighting over a toy sword. If the body is not Ursa's, then we must assume she is still alive. And I will not abandon her. We only know she was taken, not who took her. I can help with that. Ursa has an enemy among the Osara. A warlord named Durval. Impossible. Every clan in the claim has been hunting for him since the liberation. He has to be dead by now. No other Osoram had the motive and ingenuity to lure Ursa into this trap. I expect to find him lurking somewhere near the border. I've already sent an agent to investigate. He'll be waiting for word from us at the marketplace in Pitchcliffe. I can't move troops to the border without provoking the Osoram. But I could send a few vanguardsmen. And perhaps an exceptionally gifted Nora as well. Errant, Murad. Let me discuss it with her privately. Oh, he wants that private meeting, eh? <laughs> I hate to impose further after all you've done, but this is a matter of great importance to me. It sounds like Ursa means a lot to you. Without her Asaram vanguard, I would not have been able to liberate Meridian and end my father's brutal reign. Since then, it has been difficult to maintain peace between our tribes. But Ursa has a way of making her people see reason. So you see, I need her back at my side. And quickly. Who is Durval, exactly? To understand Durval, you must first understand my father. He truly thought of himself as a sun god. His mind was broken. He believed that blood sacrifice would solve, well, everything. So he raided the other tribes for victims, especially the Asaram. Durval fought back. He crafted powerful weapons and rallied his people. My father responded with the ultimate cruelty. He captured Durval's wife, and daughter, and sacrificed them in the Sun Ring. Damn. So, why would Durval go to so much trouble to kidnap Ursa? He felt she betrayed him. She fought by his side until she realized he planned to raise Meridian and butcher its people. And she came to me. Together, we stopped him and liberated the city from my father. Durval has spent every moment since trying to get revenge. Mostly on the other Asaram who fought with us. He made so many powerful enemies. I thought we'd seen the last of him. I was wrong. I'd like to ask you something about the Sundom and its politics. By all means. They call you a sun god who killed his own father in order to unite the tribes in harmony. Is any of it true? They say you can see the invisible, split an arrow at 50 paces, and tame machines at a glance. How much of that is true? It's not too far off. Well, I would like to unite the tribes in harmony, but you saw how many courtiers I have to deal with first. Maybe next week. Quite a place you've got here. You can almost see the little people below the mesa. You don't approve? Well, I have a secret for you. Neither do I. But we must be patient. Change won't come in a single sunrise. But will it happen at all, while men live in palaces? It might. Eventually. If people like you help me bring it about. Your politics seem... very complicated. The Asaram are friends, but enemies too? I couldn't have liberated Meridian without the help of Ursa and her Asaram freebooters. Many of them have settled here. But the Eldermen of the Asaram clans and the Claim have become jealous of their success. So have many Karja nobles. It's a volatile situation, especially given the fact that my father raided the Asaram for years. Ursa helps keep the peace. Promising a future based on mutual gain. But some, like Durval, will never let go of their venom. What can you tell me about the Shadow Karja? What do they have to do with Ursa? 
They are remnants of my father's regime, holding out at the fortress of Sunfall to the west. Like him, they care only for domination, and seek to draw upon the power of the sun by spilling blood in its name. Since Ursa helped me take this city from them, they were perfect scapegoats. Durval knew this, of course, and planned it well. I need to get going. I know. Well, they say kings should never beg. But please, help me find Ursa. Who says that? Well, Murad, for one. Don't hesitate to ask him or Aaron if you have further questions. All right, then. Uh-oh. Hold up, hold up. What you got here, man? You got something I can read? Oh, yeah, yeah. So let's check that out. Oh, look at that. Whole bunch of shit. <laughs> there you go. Put it on slow-mo so you can read that. <laughs> yeah, I ain't reading all that crap. Let's get out of here. All right, what you got to say about it, man? So, I thought Ursa was dead, and I thought Durval was dead. Dead doesn't seem to mean what it used to. Well, maybe I'm just an ass. Whatever. All I know is that it's time to find my sister and get some payback. I hope Murad's guy grabs us a lead. Did Ursa ever tell you anything about Durval? Well, we were both under his command for a while. Sort of. Helped him recruit an army to take out the mad Sun King. But then he got real creepy with Ursa. Needless to say, she wasn't interested, but he wouldn't let it go. Not to mention the fact that we realized he wanted to murder every Karja, not just the bad ones. Long story short, he's a grazer-licking dumbbag. Huh? Avad seems committed to finding your sister. Yeah, those two got along. And some people say they shacked up, but I, I don't buy it. Seems a little skinny for her. Oh, okay, some bad images are forming in my head. Let's just focus <laughs> on finding her. And kicking Durval's ass. I'd better go. Don't stand me up in Pitchcliff, okay? Ursa needs us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What about this guy? Aloy. How can I be of service? It's obvious that you're an advisor to the Sun King, but what is it you do exactly? Whatever is needed, of course. Are you always so evasive? It depends. Oh man, he's got all kinds of questions. You were right about Avad. He seems genuine. He is the Sun King. I serve him the best I can. What else would you have me say? Huh. Did you serve the last one as best you could too? Well, I served him to his enemies. It was the best I could do for the Sundom. What did you do? Nothing I could be blamed for. <laughs> Sounds to me like you're a spy. There are many helpful voices in the Sundom and beyond. I like to think of myself as a good listener. So why do they call you Blameless Maraud? Well, it depends on who you mean by they, and what they might wish to blame me for. <sighs> Talking to you is tiring. So they say. What will I find at the border? An outpost full of Osaram, most of whom want nothing to do with Durval. Still, he inspires great loyalty in those who fought with him against the last Sun King. He will not be caught alone. And don't forget, he is a master craftsman. Nothing delights him more than his dangerous toys. What makes you so sure Durval did this to Ursa? I don't care for sure or certain. I prefer likely or probably. How many Osram are clever enough for this ruse? Capable of building the weapon you described? Who hate Ursa so? More than one? Not likely. Durval? Quite probably. Even if people think he's dead? That is surely another reason to be suspicious of certain words. I have to go. Then you must. 
All right, then. Well, since this one's so far away and I did a bunch of talking and everything, I don't think I'm going to go and do this mission on this video. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go open up this uh, this uh, tall neck here so we can see the map. So I'm going to head that way. All right, we got a tall neck right over here. Oh, Company. shit. It's right in the middle of a damn nest of folks. Wasn't expecting that. <laughs> All right, whoa, man. Whoa, let me off. I got some business to take care of. What are they doing here? Was not expecting this. All right. It looks like they're trying to capture the tall neck. It's my tall neck. Let me sneak up here. Oh shit! Somebody sees me. Okay. Don't worry about me, man. Stop that. Oh, damn. Thought I had him. Heavy strike, bitch. Get off me. Oh, damn. Dodged right out of him. Oh, that was just me being terrible. <laughs> All right, fast shots, fast shots. Come on. Yeah, bitch. Take that. Alright, is there somewhere I can get up even higher here? Still sniffing Let me get my precision back out. Come on. Slow down. Dodging too much, man. Uh oh. Trying to rain the fire down on me. Sorry. Where you at? Walk right into it, damn it. No. Oh man, my shots are terrible. Oh, my shots are terrible if I don't pull them all the way back. All right, let me go. Can I get up there? Come on, let me up, let me up, let me up. Damn it. Nope, no jumping up there. All right, fine, fine. fine. I'll stop all that nonsense. Man, you son of a bitch. Oh, damn. Keep... Man, you know what? I'm about tired of this shit. Let me up here. Uh-huh. Can't shoot through the wall? Get back, bitch. Heavy strike. Alright, maybe these little arrows will take this guy out. I get him. There we go. What you got? Give me that. Let me make some more of these up. Man, I'm gonna have to get some more wire soon. Let me make my way over here closer. Yeah, maybe I'll use some some more regular arrows. Got some fly box, huh? Oh, this guy sees me. He's raining down fire too, huh? I can get out of this. You're in. Heat <laughs> hand. There we go. Headshot. Oh man. Got somebody on the ground shooting at me. Oh shit, they got a big ass robot. No. I didn't notice a big ass robot. Let me get some precision so that we can take some of these fools out. Oh, damn. Come on, get the shot. There we go. Damn. Oh, damn. That didn't take him out. Come on. Shoot him in the knee. Alright, who else we got? Okay, you gotta get right in my face. Oh, you bastard. Let none escape right, the shadow. You wanna fight? Let's go. Ah! 
baby. All up on you. Give me that. Oh, damn. Oh, no. I got one of those too, you son of a bitch. Come on. Oh no. Running, running. <laughs> oh damn. You son of a bitch. Get off me with all that. Come on, heal up. Oh shit, this dude's got a big gun. Oh damn, I jumped down too. Son of a bitch. Okay. You gotta watch out for this big ass robot. Where'd it go? Well, I know I can get back up over here. Come on, let me up. There we go. Dude, with a skull on his head ain't no joke. Let's see if we can precision shot him from here. Oh no, he disappeared. Man, I want to get up top on that. get around this bastard to do it. Uh-oh. Let me release that. Come on. No, no, no. I'm not here. Don't worry about me. Don't worry about me, man. Yeah. Alright, come on. Concentrate. Ah, oh, damn it. I can't hit him from here. That guy in the neck. Damn, that didn't do anything. All right, there's our guy. Concentrate. Right in the head. Come on, one more. Let me get it. Oh, come on. There we go. Oh wait, is that what those big? That's what those symbols are. Oh shit. I don't know what these arrows are for. But I want that big ass going. I got the gun. Where y'all at? I wonder if I can take this machine out. Oh, good God. Damn. I didn't know it was that badass. Let's move on around like we own this place. Who else wants some? See some more bitches over here. I want to know what those arrows are for. They're giving up. They're giving up. No, nah, man. Uh oh, she means it. <laughs> they don't see her anymore. Ain't nobody giving up, man. About to kill everybody up in this bitch. That guy. You. Get some shots. Oh man, can't hit him. You ready to fight, bitch? Come on. Oh. Yeah, eat these bullets. Man, you better get that shit out of here. Oh, shit. Alright. We're about to go in on this dude. Here we go. Concentrate. Ah, oh, right beside his head. Damn it. Oh, man, I hate how when you don't pull it all the way back. I mean, it, it's legit, but <laughs> damn it, man. All my shots missing. 
trying to get two shots into the concentration. There we go, headshot. All right, did we get them off of them now? I don't think we got to deal with anybody at this point. There's a lot of shit to pick up here. I'm gonna pick that up afterwards. I do want to know what's up with that, with these arrows though. I'll have to figure that out. Get back to y'all on that. <laughs> All right, we gotta get on this tall neck. I know we need to run around here, cause I didn't see a way to get up there on this one. Might be, but I know we can get up over here. So let's go, 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 go. We gotta outrun him. There's a way up that one, but he's still moving this way. I think we can do it. Oh, come on, stop. Stop slowing down. Oh, damn, I think he got past us here. Damn it, man. All right, well, we're gonna have to wait. All right, she's coming on back around. Now's our chance. Ready? Go! There we go. Okay, time to climb up to its head. All right. So I need to get on this one. Yeah. Climb on up this way. I did look, and the hard point arrows are for the Shadow Hunter bow. I don't have that yet, so I need to get it. All right, almost there. Come on. Jump up, jump, get it. Bam, we did it. Override this bastard. take a look and see what we got opened up oh yeah we only got two more to get we'll have the whole map opened up nice uh, did we level up enough to do something yes we did all right skill three let's see what do we want strike from below strong strike that doesn't seem too bad oh longer roll Okay, I might get that. Double shot. Oh, that seems pretty good, too. That seems good, too. <laughs> it all seems pretty good. Let's go with... Let's get the dodge. There we go. Do a super dodge now. All right, then. That's going to do it for this one. Uh, on the next one, we'll go ahead and uh, go meet those guys and see what they can tell us about old Aaron's sister see what's up so I'm gonna loot this place up and get a save and we'll be done from here so as always thanks for watching the video I appreciate it if you like the video like and subscribe and I'll see you next time